Okay, I'm running a little late. I'm not the first time I'm doing this, so I'm uh, getting started a little late. And I'm going to have to do this without my glasses most of the way through because that ring light just shines right off of the lenses and will probably blind you guys like it does me. Um, and if you have any questions, just post them there and I'll be uh, more than happy to answer anything. And I see that Tommy's there. Hi, Tommy. I've missed you and Stephanie. Hi. And my cousin Lisa. Hey, Lisa. Hope everybody's having a good night. Great to see y'all on here. Sorry I'm running late, guys. Um, this is going to be shareable and easily um, sent on to uh, other people. Or if you want to watch it again later with some friends, you are um, more than able to do that. You're probably familiar with the lives. Um, I've watched so many, but I've never done one before, so this is all new for me. So um, we'll probably get a few giggles along the way because I tend to do that anyway. What's life if you can't make people laugh, right? <laughs> okay, so here we go. I did introduce, and I don't know how many people got to see um, my short video yesterday felt long to me. It was 18 minutes, but um, uh, to me that was forever, but for you guys, it might have been even longer if you were bored. Uh, let's see. I have, um, these are our pharmacy catalogs, and these are the December, um, actually, uh, these were the October through December ones, and I have my new ones coming in the mail any day now along with some new products that I've got coming. So, um, we can uh, talk about those when they come. I'll, I'll get on here and do another little live or video and um, let you all know what we've got new. Right now, I can tell you that we now have um, what is called uh, Be Fit. And it's great for anybody who likes to um, work out or you know a lot of people like to wear makeup out riding their four-wheelers or or doing anything outdoors if they like to walk or whatever and this is this is a light makeup that um, uh, does have an SPF um, if you are outside and it uh, the mas mascara is waterproof and you don't have the powder products um, there is a face powder if you'd like to use it, but the um, the lip stain and the blush are both um, both a liquid, so they work really, really well to give you a little bit of color, but not too much. Uh, if you're like me, you don't need any extra color. You can see how red my cheeks are now. Part of that is just nervousness. The other part is lupus. <laughs> it does uh, not so great things to me, but. Um, this is my nice little pharmacy box that came for me. It had uh, all kinds of stuff in here. Um, the samples that we get of the different, this is the CC cream. Hope I'm not holding it upside down with my glasses. To me, uh, it could be upside down and I wouldn't know it without my glasses. And we got um, a nice uh, blush that came in it, uh, extra little bags. Uh, for when people buy things, we give you a really nice little bag to take it in. And um, let's get started on doing a, a little bit of makeup demonstration here. And, you know, I put a lot of positive posts. Uh, I try to stay as positive as I can on Facebook. We have enough negativity in life. And if you know me and you know my page, you also know that I'm a Christian. And... Um, I believe that it is perfectly fine to wear makeup and it's up to you what you want to wear. Um, I myself don't like a whole lot of makeup, um, but you can do a very tasteful makeup or you can go um, to some of the darker shades or more sparkly with everything that pharmacy has. The other great thing about pharmacy is that it is very affordable even if you don't um, become a beauty influencer. And I like that term. Um, that's better than salesperson or 
um, anything else some of the other companies come up with. Okay, the first thing I'm going to put on here is um, the VFX Pro Camera Ready. This is um, a primer for your makeup, and I've never used a makeup primer until um, pharmacy. And theirs is, <laughs> it's wonderful. It makes your uh, foundation go on so well, and it feels like silk on your face. It's not sticky and it doesn't leave behind um, a residue. It just helps to fill in um, where you would have all these little lines when you put on your makeup. Because I, at 56, am now getting um, some fairly deep lines around my mouth that I hadn't noticed before. And um, they're getting more and more noticeable. Of course, around my eyes too. Um, I tend to be a squinter, which isn't a real good thing, but um, this this uh, primer really helps to fill in those, those lines so that your, um, your makeup doesn't settle in there on you. So that, there's also another kind that's called pro, uh, strobe, not pro, <laughs> it's called strobe. <laughs> it's the VFX Pro. And, um, and it's the strobe, and it's for, like, if you work with a light like this, um, if you do a lot of videos for whatever kind of work that you do, because so many people that work from home, um, they do a lot of videos. And I'm just going to check here and see if we have any new people. Oh, hi, my Bobby is watching. Hey, baby. And Rachel. Hi, Rachel. It's good to see you. Vicki. Hi. People from Cincinnati, people from Kentucky. Oh, it's good to see y'all. Makes me feel loved. Okay, let's see. Next is, um, I like the um, CC color control um, because I have such pinkness in my cheeks. And the CC, uh, it's actually like the Beauty Balm, but this is Skin Perfecting Balm. Um, they also have the uh, BB ball, the BB uh, cream, and it's the Beauty Balm, and um, it has more moisture to it. Now, uh, people also do mix those two things, and um, that can be really, really popular too. It can you you can mix any of these varieties of um, makeup. Now, some people use the sponges. Some people use brushes. Myself, I'm going to go with a, a sponge tonight because um, that's what I've had the most experience with lately because I've been playing around with my pharmacy stuff and trying to do it right here. So we'll see what I can do right. Wish me luck because I can't have my uh, glasses on and do this. So hopefully I don't put myself in the eye. But, um,. It's best to get some dots of the makeup on you and just sponge it on. And this stuff has really, really good coverage. Now, um, I do have a color guide that I got from them and it cost me all of a dollar and a quarter. <laughs> See, they don't overcharge their uh, beauty influencers to be able to do their job. That's another thing I love about this company. They really, really are very reasonable with their products, but they're also uh, very quality products. Um, the CC cream goes on really well. I just really like the way that it does. It doesn't feel like I've even got anything on my face, to be honest. I don't know if you can see the difference, but I feel like it's really toned down my redness quite a bit without playing up my lines that are around my mouth. There we go. And, um, if you do decide to become a beauty influencer, 
with pharmacy, uh, you get all your products half price. You can't beat that. Because, um, let's see, the CC creams, I believe are $16.95, and you get that for half price. <laughs> you can't buy <laughs> the CC creams by CoverGirl and Maybelline at the Walmart for that price. Um, let's see. Let me put on a little eyeliner. And this I have to be very careful with because I go more by a... Uh, now my eyeliner is the one thing I don't have by pharmacy yet. Um, I'm using my trusty, I don't even know what brand it is and I can't read it because of my glasses. <laughs> so I just have to kind of go with the flow here and I'm sorry if I'm looking right at you all, but this is the only way I can do it. But um, you can get all kinds of colors of eyeliner from pharmacy. They have a beautiful teal and a, and a sparkly blue that um, I know several women and girls that that would look so pretty on them. And they're also very, very reasonable. You can go on my website and check those out. It's just pharmacy, F-A-R-M-A-S-I-U-S dot com Marcia Neal and I'll, that's also on my Facebook page if you want to check that out and um, let's see here I'm going to get a little bit of powder because I like to have some powder underneath my um, eyes because I tend to get my eyeliner and um, it goes underneath my uh, lower lid and just looks terrible but um, you know it's been a couple years since I've actually been able to wear any eye makeup so I just stopped wearing makeup altogether because my after I lost I had lost like 80 pounds and um, my eyelids were just really droopy. I didn't know I could do anything about it until the eye doctor said, um, we really need to do something about those eyes. The next time you come back, we're gonna schedule you for, and he said the medical term for it, and I can't blah, blah, blah. <laughs> anyway, it's basically an eye lift, and he said it, it's definitely bad enough that it's interfering with your eyesight. Um, so we won't need to get that taken care of and so I came back and home and talked to Bobby about it and I said I'm just going to go ahead and get that done because I want to be able to see better when I'm driving maybe I won't get so sleepy all the time because um, you know when you don't see daylight I think it makes you sleepy that's how I am anyway so let's see now I'm going to go with now this is one of the pretty um, eyeshadow trios that uh, Pharmacy offers. And um, this one actually came in my um, kit that I had ordered. Uh, there is a kit you can get for um, I'll have to double check on that for you. I think it was the $25.99 kit. You get, um, you get some nice items in that. And um, I really like this and these it, I, <laughs> we went over to uh, my parents house to have uh, to meet up with my niece Nikki and her husband Michael and see their new baby Charlotte and um, oh, she was gorgeous I just love that um, I miss holding babies. We don't have any in the family close around here, so I have to grab them when I can. And we had so much fun visiting with them. But anyway, I took my makeup along to put on in the car. 
because Bobby was driving, and I left every brush I had at home. I had no brushes to put on my makeup, and right now it's taking me forever to find my brushes because I can't see without my glasses. So anyway, here we go. I'm going to put on, first I'm going to go with this light color of the eyeshadow here. Put it just at the top. Little in the corner here. And then get my other brush and I'm gonna go hmm since I've got on rose, I think I'm going to go with the rose color here, if you can see that. Let's see if anybody's got any questions. Oh, hi, Lindsay. <laughs> Let's see. Hi, Carissa. And Brandon. Rita Renee Brown. Hi, Rita. Got those babies settled down. Okay, here we go. Now, I've already got a little bit of that color anyway. Charlie, no working. I think that is going to have to come get you. Um, I still have some of the bruising and discoloration from the surgery, and it's just about the same color as this eyeshadow. But we're giving it a try here and see how it works out. It's pretty dark, but I still have a little bit of hooded eyes, but that's because I still have some swelling. But I can see my eyelids now right here, and I couldn't see that before my surgery. I couldn't even wear mascara because it would never dry, and I would have, <laughs> I would have... Uh, mascara lines along here that looked like I had painted on eyelashes. It was awful. Um, but that is so much better now, and I'm thankful for that. So there we go with that. And I'm not comfortable with putting on eyeliner on my upper lid yet because it's still real sensitive. And, um, and I don't see well enough to put it on yet. But that will come, I promise. Now, another thing that I got is this 3D mascara. This stuff is awesome. It's a build buildable mascara so that you can make it just as voluminous and long as you want your lashes to be as you put it on. And um, let's see here. I believe Reed has got something to say. <laughs> she's got Russie down. Now she's got to get the other two hooligans to chill. Oh, I feel ya. My puppies do that to me. But I think they're easier to settle down than kids. All I gotta do is give them a bone. <laughs> We're good to go. <laughs> okay, so here we go with some of this eyeliner. Now, again, I go more by feel than I do by what I see because I'm half blind without my glasses. But, I... <laughs> Again, I'm 56. I've been putting on makeup since I was 14, so it's not so hard to do it just by feel. But I really like this mascara. It is not waterproof, but the great thing is I have never, ever had a, a non-waterproof mascara that um, didn't smudge or flake on me and I wore this I the last time I put it on I put it on and wore it for two days without taking it off I know shame on me but um, that's what I did I wore it for two days I was so tired at Christmas time I just I just had no energy after everything was said and done and uh, I lived in my pajamas for a couple of days and I did not take off this mascara. I did not get one flake. I didn't, that didn't smudge under my eyes, nothing. And I was so impressed. 
Um, they also have a, well, actually they have three or four different mascaras. And one of them actually makes you look like you have falsies on. They, it's, it's really, really good. I don't know if you can see the difference after me putting on this because I have very thin, light, short lashes and this gets them just how I want them because I, I'm not a super big lash person, um, but I do like to be able to tell a difference when I put on my mascara. Okay. All right, so there's my eyes. That's about what I do with my eyes. As I go along and I get more confident in doing these lives and I get um, some other shades of uh, eyeshadow, um, I'll get more bold and, and we'll see what we can do with some other things. But um, right now I've got out my highlighter for the face and um, I'm going to start with uh, this uh, darker one right here to go under my cheekbones. So I'm going to take this. <laughs> I'm using my pants like a towel to get off residue from previous tryings here. And I'm going to put this on on the part underneath my cheekbones because I'm a chubby cheeked grandma. And that's okay. It's what I'm supposed to be what God made me but sometimes I like to have a little cheekbone emphasized so I'm going to put on just a little bit of emphasis right here with this darker color and then I'm going to go with my actual blush color I can get it open. Make sure I have the right one. There's one that's like really orange and it is not my color whatsoever. And then there's this one that I like okay, but there's another one I've got coming that um, I'm going to like better. That one is just, it's not quite pink enough for me. Because I like one pink. And I put that right on top of my cheekbones. Take it all the way back. Now, I have, I have not a lot of natural pink in my face, but when I put on that CC cream, it really, really evens out my color. So that gives me room to um, build up a little bit of uh, the pretty color that pharmacy gives you. And if Bobby were in here with me, he'd say, but honey, you don't need that makeup. You're beautiful just the way you are. But that's what a loving husband says. If they don't tell you that, they're not very loving. And you may want to rethink your choices. Anyway, that's my view. Um, Alright, next we've got this highlighter. And this will go um, above your cheekbone, a little bit around your eyes. Um, anywhere you want to kind of highlight a little bit um, this color in the middle I'm gonna put that on either side of my nose to thin it down a little bit um, I almost forgot to do that get a little other brush I just want to put that a little bit on either side of my nose we call it the human nose that's kind of a little bit of a ski slope there and then wide on the sides, that's the human nose. Um, human is my maiden name, for those who don't know that. But most of the people I see on here already know that. So, And they're humans too, in one way or another. Married to one or been in the family. So here we go. And here goes my highlight. I'm just going to put a little bit around here. A little bit around here. Excuse my hair. I didn't do much with it after my shower. Um, I was hot and my neck and shoulder were hurting so I got on the heating pad which of course that made me hotter. Okay, you want to take a little of the highlighter and put it right in your cupid's bow. Right there. Did you know that was called a cupid's bow? 
I didn't. Not till I got with pharmacy and heard other people call it that. Makes sense though. Um, I put a little under my chin too. Um, okay, so the one thing that I myself have a little bit of trouble with my eyebrows and I don't like to do them but the older I get the sparser my eyebrows get so I'm gonna do a little something something with them and this is um, actually it's a brown it's called brow design but it's a, basically a brow mascara and uh, I actually really like it um, Believe it or not, I haven't made any huge mistakes yet, but I am going to put on my glasses to do this. Have them down low so I can see what the heck I'm doing. So I don't make it too dark. It's hard to do, though, when, you, when your glasses are in your way and you're trying not to make this big line that goes in the actual absolutely opposite direction that you want your lashes or your eyebrows to go. And it gives you a little fuller look to your brows and a little darker look, which is what I need because my eyebrows, um, they can be thick enough right here above that front corner of my eye, but when it comes to that curve, my brows have started to disappear. Not a good thing. But um, I don't go for big thick brows either. I come from the generation that plucked them to death, so <laughs> I haven't learned to be brave with giving myself great big eyebrows. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe you can tell me if I smudged them up because I really can't see much there. You're going to have to give me a grade when I'm done with this. Okay. The only thing I haven't done yet is um, lipstick. That was the other thing I was going to do with my kit, my welcome kit. This was the 1999 kit. Um, came with all of these nice little, and you can see I've got several out, but that's because I've been playing with them. Um, but there is one called Dusty Rose, if I can find it, which is my favorite. And um, they also have a... Pharmacy has a lip conditioner that is really, really good to put underneath your lipstick. Um, it's just so creamy. You can even wear it alone. It has a shine to it. And then they have a lip clumper. Um, I've got that and the lip conditioner coming. Um, the lip clumper uh, just has a little tingle to it. And the secret to using that, if you just use it once a week, you're not going to see much plumpness to your lips. You're not going to see much difference. You have to use it, you know, at least a couple of times a day. And then it'll build up to where your lips just stay plumper. Um, the more you use it, the plumper your lips are going to be. <laughs> I mean, they're not going to get like, you know, look like you had injections or anything like that. But they will plump up a little more and be a little prettier. Anyway, I... I'm going to put on this little lipstick here. This is, I believe, the Dusty Rose. Now, I normally just wear some lip liner if I'm going to wear anything on my lips. Um, <laughs> I hope I got that straight. Um, their lip liners are very, very creamy 
and you can actually use them as a lipstick or you can line with them and then put a lipstick you really like um, right in the center. I made my Cupid's bow disappear when I did that. But anyway, there's my makeup I promised you. And this is without my glasses, with my glasses. Oh, Bobby said to mention the men's products. Yes, there are men's products. The men's products are really, really good. Um, there is a um, shampoo um, that's actually for uh, hair and the body. Um, and there is, I think what is probably the most popular thing is the beard oil. Um, let me see if I can find it here in the book and I can give you an estimation here on, well, I can give you the exact amount of the price. Okay, uh, there's men's colognes. Um, the gaucho is very, very uh, popular. Uh, there's also Shooter's Man. The clones run about $35.90. If you are a beauty influencer, it will be half that price. And let's see here. The Men's Pharmacy Energizing Shampoo Body and Face Wash. Um, and it is $10.90 for the bottle. That is, um, let's see, 13 and a half fluid ounces. So that, that's pretty good. As a beauty influencer, if you join with pharmacy, you get that for half price. So it would only be $5.45 for that bottle for you to get for your man. Or if you're one of the men that's on here right now and want to sign up, hey, look what you get. You get half price on your beard oil and uh, they even have a men's eye cream. If you're an older man and you are um, wanting to take care of those fine lines around your eyes or if you have droopy eyes like I had um, it is only uh, $9.90 and with um, your 50% discount if you join up it is uh, just going to be $5.45 I'm, I'm sorry $4.45 you cannot beat that the beard oil is $14.90 before your discount. You'd get it half off if you or your uh, better half decides to join pharmacy. And the great thing about pharmacy, if you join, it's $19.99 to join. Once you join, there is nothing else ever to pay. As long as you um, purchase $1 worth of stuff a year, you stay with pharmacy and who can't do that um you get the 50 percent discount you also get bonuses um the the more that you sell um throughout the month the more you get paid of course and um you just can't you just can't beat that um let me see what else would I want to bring to your attention? Oh, y'all give me a grade on what I did on my makeup because um, this was a, a first time run for me and I want to know what I can do better. Let's see, there's a brow powder. I, I, uh, I think that would be really great to use uh, instead of or along with the mascara, the brow mascara. Um, eyebrow liner also and the eyebrow pomade. The serum foundation. This is what I have coming and what us uh, older women um, really, really seem to like. And it uh, is luminous. It's not shiny, but it gives you a nice um, luminous satin glow to your skin. And um, it, uh, it really helps to fill in those fine lines so that they're not showing so much. And it's $22.90. If you become an influencer, then it's half price. So it would be um, $11.45. Their prices just amaze me because any other product that I have looked at, um, makeup and everything, is so much more expensive uh, when you get right down to it. Even before 
uh, if you're not a beauty influencer and you're paying full price, it's still a great price for their products and they are quality products. A doctor um, started on these products on the skincare line and the skincare lines, I gotta tell you, um, they do have baby products. There's baby lotion, baby shampoo, um, everything for the diaper area that you need, uh, baby oil, baby soap. Um, let's see, I'll have to get some of that for the grandbabies and send it up to Lindsay. Let's see. The Age Reversist. I've got some of that coming that I got free. Um, there is the serum, the rich moisturizer, gel cleanser, and eye cream. And um, it's like getting the Olay, um, you know, just as a comparison. That is a really good product, and I will admit that. But the Age Reversist that Pharmacy carries, it has a really good reputation. Um, and the, um, the rich moisturizer, I've heard such good things about, and the eye serum, um, you can put it on, and, uh, let me get this right quick. My run wonderful husband got me one of these for Christmas, and, um, it's for my face, in my eye area, since I had my surgery, I wanted to give this a try. And you can put this in the refrigerator and get it nice and cool and rub it all around. And if you put on the Age Reverses Serum or any of the serums, because there's three different serums besides that one um, in, in all of the lines, um, turn this on. And with this cold, you just rub it after you put that serum on your face. And it will help you so much with um, with getting that deeply into your your pores and um, getting you a, a deeper uh, deeper moisturization than you thought you you could get with any kind of oil. Um, I, I'm not pushing that. I don't get anything for pushing that. It's just it's a really good product too, and I think it would go really well with the serums that pharmacy carries. Um, and there is also a pure rose oil line for skin care. And uh, that's the next thing I'd really like to try. Tea tree. The tea tree line is huge. It's great for people with, um, with T-zone problems, with acne. Um, it really works well because it actually has tea tree essential oil in the products. Uh, there's a serum, and there's uh, a cream, there's face cream, there is a face tonic, which is really important for people who are troubled with acne. Um, there is also a tea tree and mint toothpaste. Now, what I've heard from people who use this toothpaste is that it is not advertised to make your teeth white, but they get uh, very white teeth from this, as well as... Um, it is made for people with sensitive teeth, which is me, so I'm going to be getting some. Um, and the tea tree soap, women, it is wonderful for cleaning your makeup brushes. You just take that soap bar, and you take your makeup brush, and get your soap bar wet, and you just rub, 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 rinse, and you ha your makeup brushes will be like brand new again. And um, since tea tree oil is um, antibacterial. It gets those brushes in really good shape for you. It will be bacteria free um, again for you. So um, get on my website and take a look at what we've got to offer and if you decide you uh, want to learn more about becoming a beauty influencer with pharmacy, just get a hold of me. I'm always here. And hi Dinah. Hi Angie. Give your mama a hug for me. And um, it's really great seeing everybody on here. I thank, I thank you so much for the encouragement and everybody showing up. That means so much. But um, I'm going to uh, say goodbye and let you all go. I've kept you on here for almost an hour. And um, 
just send me any questions you might have about it. Give me a call on the phone. Uh, get on Messenger. Um, I'm available. And if I can help you in any other way, you need prayer for something, or you just want to talk, I'm here. It's good to see everybody. You all have a great evening, and I hope you had a good time with me. I'll talk to you later. Love y'all. Bye.